This is Hester. And this is Maria. And together they are... The, the Concert Counselors! Today we present to you a few exercises in a circle. We keep the circle open for you, but you can close the circle when you practice yourselves. And they are all based on contemporary techniques and improvisation. We suggest that you work on these exercises with at least four people together and we are even with five of us because again we have a few of the recorder students uh, of the Amsterdam Conservatoire with us. Here is again Gabriel from Spain and Paul from Germany and Patricia from Denmark. Thank you for helping us out. Yes, yes. thank you. For these exercises of today please take all a treble or alto recorder in 440. If you happen not to be a fan of contemporary music, I am quite sure you will like these exercises because they are fun to do and they focus on your concentration and your reaction to what other people do. And uh, they also serve as a sort of warm up for your daily practice in the group. The first exercise is called a nine beat composition. We are going to count until nine, four times in a row. And we are each going to pick one secret number between one and nine. On that number, you play a pitch of your own choice. And you play that pitch the full length of that beat. And you add a finger vibrato to that pitch so that it sounds spooky, like this. If you notice that uh, one of your colleagues has chosen the same beat, the same number to play their spooky note, that is not a problem, of course, that's very nice, in fact. And uh, you will always play the same pitch on the number you picked. Yes, and we are also going to use a little bit of help, namely the metronome, which is lying on the ground. We are going to set that to 60 beats per minute. We are going to count until four, and then the game starts. Four cycles of nine beats. One, two, three, four. number of your choice so pick a different number than you picked before and on that number we are going to make a extreme air noise that can be a short percussive sound or you can play the full length of the beat again or anything in between as long as it is something with air and it has no pitch at all Yes, and we are going to add this new uh, number to the one that we already played in the exercise before. So that means you still play your pitch with finger vibrato in the number that you chose before. And now on the new number you have picked, you make your air effect. And once more, we are going to repeat the whole exercise four times in a row with counting until four uh, before and with the help of the metronome. Enjoy. Three. excellent the piece is getting really interesting and we are still going to add one more factor now each of us is going to choose one more number different to the two previous and on that number we are going to make a sound involving our voice and taking one beat or shorter 
It can be in the recorder or outside the recorder, it can be a word, it can be a sound, anything involving your voice. And let's try to be creative and maybe even a bit crazy. And let's see no if once we know the pattern, um, we can see if you can react a bit to each other, what comes before you, what comes after you, to make it even more interesting. And let's repeat again four times nine beats. Three, four. <laughs> The next exercise is called 60 beater and we are all going to count as a group and we are going to divide our group in four parts which means that Patricia and me are group one, Paul is group two, Gabriel is group, group three and Maria is group four. <laughs> we are go going to count in the following way. Group one is going to count until three and repeats this all the time. So one, two, three, one, two, three. Yes, and Paul is gonna count on the same speed but until four. So one, one, two, three, four, and so one, on. two. Exactly. And then we have Gabriel counting until five and myself counting until six. And we keep repeating and repeating and repeating until we all together say one. one. And when this is, you can calculate this in your head, but we are not going to do that. We are going to experience when this is. So, good luck, everybody. One, two, three. One, 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 two, 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 that was fantastic and if you made the calculations in your in your head then uh, you notice that we all came together on the one on the 61st beat and that means that uh, the group number one they counted until three 20 times group number two counted until four 15 times group number three counted until five 12 times and i counted until six 10 times it's a miracle let's try to do it again but not this time we are going to make it a little bit more difficult for ourselves uh, we are only going to count the one and the rest of the counts we keep silence. One. 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 One, 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 one. <laughs> right, so now we're going to make an actual piece of music based on these numbers we were counting. And how we will do that is as follows. We're going to replace our one by a long C and we are all going to think of a pattern for the amount of notes we are playing. So team one will think of a pattern of three notes starting on a middle C team two, a motive for four notes, starting on a middle C, and so on. And again, after a few cycles, we will meet all on the C. So, C a bit longer, the rest pizzicato. There we go. <laughs> Thank you. 
her mini Philip Glass piece there. Yes, that was brilliant. The next step of this exercise, um, we are going to forget about melody patterns, but we are going to uh, use our instrument for beatboxing and create a pattern on the number of beats you had before. So for example, Gabriel, could you show us your beatboxing patterns of, of five beats? Sure. several players, you can also divide the time you have to create a pattern. So for example, Hester and Patricia have a pattern in three and it goes like this. But for this last exercise, uh, let's do something special. Instead of being busy with counting and realizing when are these cycles uh, and when do we come together again, we're just going to fade out the music like in the old pop records. So we're just going to start playing forte and we're going to become softer and softer and so we will finish our improvisation. So if you have the chance to meet him, we would certainly go for it. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you have questions or comments for Hester and Maria, you can contact them here. See, See you next time! time.